Hello everyone! Welcome to CNCF DevX Day. I hope that wherever you are in the world, you're safe and well. I'm Pauline and I'll be kicking off DevX Day for you. Uh, a short introduction of me. I'm a community engineer from Gitpod and for those who don't know, we are an open source, ready to code development platform. I'm also one of the cloud native DevX program committee members and I run a newsletter all about this very topic, DevX Digest. You can say that I'm pretty excited to be hearing all about DevX today. The more I dive in, the more I find it absolutely fascinating and inspiring in terms of the direction we are going in in the industry. So what is DevX or developer experience and why should you care? Great question. So developer experience is all about our daily experience when trying to get a job done. We use a vast number of tools that help us turn the, so many awesome ideas into reality. And a good or bad experience could be the make or break relationship we have with tools. And whilst the wild number of choices are fantastic, it can be also quite confusing and overwhelming on what exactly we should be investing in. And although we have established how important DevX is, it's still an area that isn't talked about very often. And Redmonk actually gave this a name. It's called the Developer Experience Gap, in which they elaborated it as developers are forced to borrow time from writing code and redirect it towards managing the issues associated with highly complex, multi-factor developer tool chains held together in places by duct tape and bailing wire. That is fantastic and it's such a good way to explain uh, what developer this developer experience gap is all about. And I've personally definitely experienced this same pain. And we've been promised tools that were supposed to speed up the process of providing business value, getting a POC out of the door into production, and was supposed to frankly just make my life easier as an engineer. And all of these felt, felt quite fat, flat sometimes. And can you just imagine just being able to do your job rather than fighting with tools? And you know, that is what we'll be discussing in depth today and essentially what DevX is all about. Um, it's about an efficient, sustainable and joyful experience in the sea of tools and being able to find what you need and use it and get your ideas out the door. So in terms of the cloud native world, the tools we are given as developers have enabled us to be able to spin up clusters, for example, with just a click of a button. And as adoption continues to grow and the focus of the ecosystem shifting towards more to the left, i.e. to the individual developers and their experience whilst developing and deploying cloud native applications, and here's a really good example. This is the CNCF landscape. I love this meme. It's, it shows, it really shows what it's like out there. <laughs> um, and the Kubernetes learning curve, especially, um, has just exploded in our industry. And it's, it's, it's fantastic. It's such a powerful tool, but there is an increasing concern for teams adopting these cloud native patterns. And personally, this is what I experienced myself. I think it took me a good six months or something to truly understand the capabilities of Kubernetes. And um, it is it is a powerful tool and it's an absolutely brilliant tool, but is extremely complex. And it definitely is a good example of um, what it's like to have an uphill battle in terms of developer experience. At the moment, developers need to learn a lot on their journey to cloud native. We're talking packaging, containers, microservices, all remote collaboration, distributed testing and continuous integration and delivery. The question we will want to answer is how can we reduce the friction to really enable developers to feel like they have everything at their fingertips? And that's what DevX Day is all about. So 
be prepared for a jam-packed day ahead. We have a fantastic lineup of speakers from Google, IBM, New Relic, Okato, and more. They will share their stories and insights on the world of cloud native and its challenges with a focus on developer experience, of course. I'm really excited for, the, for today and I hope that you are too. Don't forget to share your CNCF experience with us on Twitter. You can use the hashtag, hashtag cloudnativecon, hashtag cndevx, and we just can't wait to see what you learn, what your experiences are, what your thoughts are, and we just really hope that you enjoy your day. And without further ado, I'd like to welcome our keynote speaker, Zain Asghar from New Relic, with his talk on how to debug in production without too much pain. Over to you, Zane.